So I'm a big fan of Boundary ML, BAML, because what it really does is super powerful. So people have figured this out pretty early with ChatGPT that you can ask for JSON responses. So you can say, hey, I'm going to take an image, give me some JSON. GPT-4 and Gemini and Claude and all of these different models will do that. Uh, they'll give you a response. But a lot of the time it's wrong or it's mangled or it's not quite there or it's actually embedded in some markdown or it's really, really messy or it's not actually correct. It's just, it's just completely made up. What BAML does is really special because we can define a specific type, a type of response that we're trying to get, uh, whether that's, you know, a regulation. Like, let's say that we're modeling regulations and we want to scan a document to find all the, the laws or legislations. We can define exactly what we're after. We can describe it. We can say that this is a required field and this is an optional field. And this really improves type safety, runtime errors, reliability and scalability, because we just, we know exactly what we're going to get.